why is everything so slow what we gonna do with the prices for bitcoin what's gonna happen in the nearest future and why the market is frozen that's what we're gonna be talking about in this video so jump welcome and let's discuss the current situation on the cryptocurrency market uh welcome i'm trying to make this videos daily to to, to stay in touch with you and um uh, guys everything hasn't changed from the previous video even the price for bitcoin is 1962 uh, we have 1.4 percent decrease over the last day of the global crypto market cap and the global crypto market cap is really extremely poor 922 billion for all the market it's quite about nothing it's three times less than capitalization of an apple brand uh and uh this is a little bit annoying actually why because all the market is quite steady all the market is in the red zone on the daily basis almost all the market is in the red zone on the uh on the weekly basis so we're gonna discuss this situation and we're gonna find out what's gonna happen in the nearest future uh with uh, bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies crypto bubbles has been sad guys red 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 color everything is flying down and there's uh there's no like bottom for this project's uh bitcoin i i do believe that bitcoin passed its bottom already and right now uh we have the situation where we can go higher or we can go lower why we're gonna discuss in a couple seconds stock market hit map today looks better than a couple days ago when everything was red today we we are also in the red zone but not quite dark okay because uh, a lot of projects were flying down and there was no chance to stop right now we we can see that uh everything is quite normal quite normal uh as we as we're gonna switch to weekly picture we can see that some projects gave some some results but i don't believe that we're gonna see something insane and something incredible in the nearest future why because altcoin season shows 63 it is not the altcoin season and you all know that when it is the altcoin season everything is so fast so exponential and everything is growing and everything is uh, pretty okay uh, but for the moment right now we don't have the the chances to get back to the altcoin season because the dominance of bitcoin is staying strong a little bit less than was but 39.8 is still strong dominance of bitcoin and that means that nothing will change nothing will change literally if we're gonna hold above 19,100 on this day then we're gonna uh, we're gonna try to uh, get to the next level uh, around 20,400 this is the local resistance and we need to surpass it to see at least something the same situation with a bnb let's switch to four hours to understand that there is also almost uh we're out of volatility we're just like freezed on the same spot okay edh the same we just moving sideways we just moving sideways it's like a dead body that that has no pulse okay uh what's gonna happen with this altcoins nothing will happen until bitcoin will start to grow yes i do believe that crypto fear and grid index shows today 23 long long time guys more than a year we we have fear and greed index showing us uh, extreme fear and it's gonna continue it's gonna continue because everything is so unpredictable and everything is so slow that a lot of investors are too worried about the current situation that means they're not investing their money because they know that they will get losses uh or they are not so confident about the current situation uh, that means that this can be a perfect buying opportunity for those people who didn't jump to the crypto market yet but 
I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not giving you any financial advices except one. Do not invest more money than you can afford to lose. Everything is quite simple. One of the goldest rules in the crypto, you need to buy the fear, you need to sell the greed. This is time to buy. As for me, decide by your own, make your own research before you want to jump to some projects. And guys, wish you good luck and wish you big profits. See ya in the next video. Bye-bye.